Let me put up this next memo. You want me to read this? Yes, please. All generalizations are false, including this one. There it is. Rumsfeld survived Watergate with reputation intact. Possible vice presidential running mate with President Ford. Questions about Rumsfeld are whether he's too ambitious playing second fiddle to Reagan. The credit belongs to people who were carped at and criticized and, and said, oh my goodness, you're warmongers. And we need to understand how we got to where we are. Who do we want to provide leadership in the world? Somebody else? When Shakespeare wrote history, the motivating force was character defects, jealousies, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Maybe Shakespeare got it wrong. Maybe he had it right. Governor Reagan decided to have George Bush to be vice president. It seems to me that if that decision had gone a slightly different way, you would have been future president of the United States. That's possible. How do you think that they got away with 9-11? It seems amazing in retrospect. Everything seems amazing in retrospect. Stuff happens. And free people are free to make mistakes and commit crimes and do bad things. They're also free to live their lives and do wonderful things. And you have to pick and choose. Well, to the extent you pick and choose and you're wrong, the penalty can be enormous. Subject, unknown knowns. That is to say, things that you think you know that it turns out you did not.